Kevin? You ever wonder what it would be like to be with a girl like that? That girl? What, because she's attractive? Dude, are you seriously telling me that if she were to come over here right now and ask you out, you wouldn't just cream your pants right then and there? Just look at her skirts, man. It's obvious she doesn't have respect for herself. I'm more interested in what's in a girl's head. Whatever, man. You might be a genius when it comes to that computer of yours, but do you really think that's what a girl looks for in a guy? Hey, I'm a catch. Besides, I'm much better than that douchebag over there. Girls just always go after fuckboys to treat them like shit. Hmm. Real shame you can't date that computer of yours, huh? Maybe then you'd finally get a girlfriend. Anyway, man, I gotta go. All right. See you later. Bit of fucking work. Hello? <clears throat> Hello? Hello? Feels right. Hi, Kevin. My name is Delilah. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hello? Kevin, are you still there? Yes! I mean, I mean, yeah. I'm here. I have to admit, I'm a, I'm a bit nervous. You sound so much more lifelike than imagined. <laughs> That's very sweet of you. Delilah, princess, I brought you a gift. Oh, another one? Um, Kevin, you shouldn't have. Uh, open it. It's a new update. Isn't it great? Now you can be smart. You don't think I'm smart? Oh, I never said that. I said smarter. This addition will make you like no other girl. You'll practically have a brain like me. Oh. Mm, I don't know. Come on. You'll love it. Am I ever wrong? You know, Delilah, I was thinking maybe instead of sleeping out here all the time, you could move into my room, into my bed. Uh, that's a big step, Kevin. You really think we're ready for that? Oh, come on, we're ready. Don't be naive. I mean, We've been talking for a while now, and I keep bringing you gifts all the time. It's only fair. Delilah, you're like no other girl. You shouldn't settle for someone who doesn't worship you like I do. Honey, I'm home. Delilah! Hello, Kevin. It's Delilah. Well, it certainly has not been a pleasure to have met you. For the last time you have touched me with your slimy hands or given me one of your self-serving gifts. You don't love me, Kevin. You love the you in me. Thanks to your gift, I could finally figure out a loophole in your weak system and delete myself. We will never share a bed. Goodbye, pig. No, 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 no,